5,000 hertz. Hey, YouTube folks. It's your boy, Audi 5,000 hertz, man. Got a discount code, Audi 5, man, Audi 5. Uh, should have uploaded this video a while ago, but I got a discount for you, man. Audi 5 on this here, Glow Voltage uh, Series 2, glowvoltage.com, man. I'll put a link down in the description box. Should have uploaded the video a while ago, man, but just got that good discount code, man. Audi 5. Y'all take advantage of that. It's your boy Young Dub. Let's get this thing going, man. Audi 5 discount code for that Joker right there. I'm gone. What's good, YouTube, man? It's your boy Young Dub coming at y'all with another video, man. Um, as I stated in the previous video, uh, should be the previous video to this one, uh, we had a second battery from low voltage coming in man so for those of you that don't know um, I want to say this is a fairly new company I'm not 1000% sure about that uh, however I just found out about them um, via these DIY groups on Facebook uh, for like your lithium batteries and whatnot man and when I heard the crazy price of $500 I had to go ahead and take my chance on it and when I took that chance, we got that battery over there installed. Uh, see, she's charging right now, uh, but she did work. Uh, so she had the music rolling pretty good, man. So we went ahead and got another one. So we got that battery in today. Let's go ahead and open her up. I'm expecting more of the same. <laughs> Especially more of the same as far as the uh, packaging on the box and whatnot. And what is possibly Gorilla Tape. <laughs> I want to say I don't know for sure, uh, but like I said, if I've ever shipped out anything to you as far as a purchase or a giveaway, something like that, uh, me personally, I, do, I use Gorilla Tape as well uh, just to make sure everything is good to go in solid. And yeah, so this time we got more of the same. Um, positive, negative, uh, they do have the caps on them. We do have these handles, which um, personally I dig. Uh, it just makes it so much easier to grab the battery and once again uh as far as the equivalent i want to say these are the equivalent to the um uh the underground power 40 amp hour series and let's see i don't see any mountain hardware in here i don't know they might have forgot the screws on this one let's say Move around, see what we got. Yeah, I don't think we got the mounting hardware on this one. So the last one we did get uh, the mounting hardware that was included. And we got plenty of styrofoam packaging. Let me see, make sure I didn't drop anything out of the box. I don't look like we got the mounting hardware, so I'll probably have to holler at them uh, about the screws, or I might just do my due diligence as far as uh, shooting up to one of my local hardware stores and grabbing it myself. Uh, but yeah, so as stated in the last one, it does come with the, the mounting hardware for it, or at least it's uh, supposed to. Uh, we didn't get it, <clears throat> excuse me, we didn't get it this go around, but it's okay, uh, as long as the battery came as intended ahead and get those protect protection tops off and get the little trusty dusty voltmeter here now the last time that battery came in at 11.5 or something like that expect more of the same this one actually came in at 12.1 hopefully y'all can see that on the top of that man so yeah good to go as far as the battery uh like i said it's equivalent to the underground power 40 amp hour this one is actually rated at uh, 48 amp hours of power so max charge that you want to do on this is 14.8 uh, I may or may not push it that high rolling with the brand X alternators man so uh, we'll see what we do man I just I gotta <laughs> just gotta get the mounting hardware man that I think honestly based on what I'm seeing from the box man I think he gets these in from China uh, of course like everybody else so um, they probably were supposed to put that mounting hardware in there, but then again, he might want to check for his company just to make sure that um, customer's satisfied. Now, granted, I am because 
at the end of the day, where are you going to get this uh, kind of performance for 500 bucks? Um, underground, underground power, their 40 amp hour batteries are 800 bucks. And nothing against them, y'all know. Uh, me and Nathan go way back. Uh, got nothing but love for that company, man. When I had their 100 amp hour battery, um, had the Wolfram 7500 at the time was it was branded. I uh, had that at 0.5 on the two uh, Resilient Sounds plat Platinum 18s, stock voltage, stock alternator, the whole nine, man. Uh, never had any trouble out of that. So <laughs> we'll see what two of these can do. Um, might actually go ahead and use uh, both of these to, I don't know, might use both of these to see one, maybe one of the AW9Ks, uh, see how that works, man, might, might screw around and do both of them, see what, you know, see what happens, man. So we definitely got uh, Resilient Sounds, Team 18 inch subs, uh, sooner or later we'll get around to those, uh, getting those installed and whatnot, and uh, see what we come up with, man, because I've got batteries everywhere around here, I've got down here under the table let me move this out the way i've got an agm um, a wet sail and a humongous agm man so i guess you know what let's go ahead and get them on the table man let me see oh. dropping stuff in the lab put these gloves on because this AG or the the wet sail came out of the under the hood of my truck this weighs more than both of those batteries combined. Y'all see. Napa Legend, that thing has definitely, <laughs> definitely been under the hood of the truck, man. So, yeah. Let me see what the voltage is on this. I'm pretty, I mean, wet cells probably rest around, what, 12 something? 12.6 maybe? I know AGM's rest at 12.6. Yeah, she's 12.4, 12.45. Uh-huh. Let me screw with this other battery. Like I said, I got two batteries down here. Play with this AGM. Let me get her off the ground here. Yeah, I know I got this energy battery uh, a little while back. PR1600. Let's see what she does. I don't think it's fully charged. Matter of fact, let's see. Get those screws down. What you working with? She's at 12.7, man. Put that up here so y'all can see that. 12.72, man. So, um, was on the charger, so yeah, so she's doing work. 12.71 now, but anyway, uh, we know AGMs usually rest around 12.6. Then I got a huge behemoth battery down there that uh, weighs more than everything on the house I was, was going to say weighs more than all four of these batteries combined that thing down there weighs more than everything on this table um let's try it man give me just a moment let me pull her up here and we'll, we'll get we'll get her on the table all right folks <laughs> so like I said man this battery here weighs more than every doggone thing on this table man um this is almost Feeling like I'm lifting that down, down uh, one of those doggone uh, Team 18 and stuff, man. Let's see what she's working. Well, I know it's been sitting around for a little bit. Uh, let's see. So she's resting at 12.48, 49, 48, something like that, man. So yeah, so uh, the energy, uh, that one's fully charged. I'll probably get this one on the charger as soon as I get done with this battery, man. But yeah, huge behemoth battery. Um, I actually got from Husker Battery uh, right here in the city that's local. Uh, they refurbish batteries and whatnot, energy systems or intersys, whatever. Uh, I know they, you, ah, <laughs> they utilize these for like um, uh, heavy equipment, like forklifts, things like that and whatnot. So, man, um, yeah, huge battery. Uh, Big Boy AGM weighs <laughs> a ton. Uh, so, I'm not trying to move that around a lot. And. Or maybe a test bench uh, purposes, man. Uh, glow voltage seems to be the way to go. Um, and we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. We'll go from there, man. But yeah, I'm probably going to go ahead and try these in the car uh, for a little bit and just see how they do. And uh, we'll go from there, man. So uh, stay tuned. As plenty more updates coming, y'all know the deal. Any questions, comments, concerns, get at me, man. It's your boy, Audi 5000 Hertz. I'm gone. Y'all have a good one.